I'm Crazy Chris, and welcome to So Cool Science. Science you can do, bring it home. I'm just looking at a star map online and going over today's science file. And today's science file says, How do we know there are other solar systems? Try this. Ow! Ow, 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 ow! You will need two different sized styrofoam balls and a toothpick. Okay, let's say that this styrofoam ball is our sun. Well, okay, it's not really our sun. I mean, if it, if it was our sun. Ow! Wow! Ow! Wow! Well, let's just pretend that this styrofoam ball was our sun. If this styrofoam ball were the size of our sun, the nearest star that has formed planets going around it would be 3,500 kilometers away! And it would be about this big, you know, com compared to this. Ah! <laughs> I'm just kidding, I'm just, you know, I'm messing with you guys. <laughs> okay, so if these stars are so far apart, how do we know that stars have planets going around them? Well, take a look at this. Okay, that was about as exciting as watching this show frame by frame. Okay, get yourself a big styrofoam ball. The toothpick is right here, I just had something in my throat. <laughs> and you want to get a smaller ball. Oh. I always keep my balls in my pants. Okay, here's what you're going to do. Put the toothpick in the big styrofoam ball and the small one on the other end. Now you're going to give this setup a spin. Now that is pretty cool. We saw it wobble back and forth. Now, we don't just know that something is going around the sun, we also know how to tell the size of the object that's going around the sun. So what are all these styrofoam balls? So what are all these styrofoam balls? So what do these styrofoam balls have to do with other solar systems? Well, don't look at me. Take a closer look at this. Exoplanets are planets that orbit around a star that is not our sun. Astronomers have found more than 300 exoplanets and believe there are billions of planets in our galaxy. Astronomers take pictures of stars in the night sky and then follow up with a picture a few days, a week, or even a month afterwards. When they compare pictures of stars, some stars seem to wobble back and forth, just like the styrofoam ball makes the bigger ball wobble. These are the stars astronomers focus high-tech equipment on when they look for exoplanets. Using sensitive brightness measuring instruments called photometers, which can detect the dimming of a star as its planet passes in front of it, we can even tell how warm the planet is by measuring the levels of infrared radiation given off by the planet. The solar system is located 20.5 light years from Earth and as of 2009 is known to have four planets to which two are Neptune size and two are just slightly bigger than our own Earth. Scientists believe that two of these planets are large rocky worlds that could possibly have life. So now you know that we are not the only solar system. You know, watching a ball wobble back and forth is why science is so cool.